Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Daily Doc Talk. This is the airport edition. I am currently uh, on my way to Canada for a wedding. And so I've been using this time to catch up on some, uh, some DMs, some social media stuff, and I had a good question that came through. The initial question um, you know, had to do with some of the differences in the different types of PRP. Um, but the, the one main question that I wanted to talk about right now was, you know, the question was, does PRP actually cause any cartilage regrowth? And so uh, this patient is, I'm assuming, suffering from some knee pain, and so that's how they were looking at this. But, you know, there's an inherent flaw in this question that I think that I just need to hammer home and address in that the it is not the change in the tissues that is going to guarantee change in pain and function and you know the results from that and so just be whether whether there is and this is something i tell patients a lot whether or whether or not there is an actual change on an mri for your cartilage doesn't mean anything to me it doesn't sure it's nice to see studies because there are some out there that show there's cartilage regrowth and things like that and it's nice when cartilage does regrow because it's kind of cool but at the end of the day, what I care about is your pain and your function. And so two scenarios, one scenario is I give you a PRP injection and you get cartilage regrowth, but your pain is the exact same and you have no more range of motion and your quality of life is the same. Or the other scenario is I give you a PRP injection, cartilage doesn't change, there's no regrowth, but your pain's reduced by 80% and your quality of life is, is up 60% and you have full range of motion. Which one would you choose? The answer is pretty obvious when you frame it like that, but a lot of people don't think that because it's been ingrained in society in this, you know, this MRI world where, oh, the imaging needs to show something, the imaging needs to show something. And so it's really important to understand that, you know, the outcomes that we're looking for is not actual regeneration per se, in the uh, actual cartilage. And we know that we get, because we've seen ultrasound studies and really good data showing that the, the PRP and the stem cells and even the prolotherapy can help to regenerate the integrity of the other soft tissue, tendons, ligaments, things like that. Cartilage is just a little different. But the important thing with, uh, with the distinction between the two is that when you're dealing with, uh, you know, let's say lateral epicondylosis and you got some degeneration in the lateral epicondyle there, you know, the, uh, the degeneration of the tissue, that microenvironment is such that there's degeneration, not a lot of inflammation. But when you look at the, uh, you know, what's happening inside of a knee joint, for example, when you have some of that cartilage degeneration and that kind of stuff, there's a lot of other inflammatory markers that are happening inside that knee and uh, that are gonna be affected by the PRP. And that's where we start to see kind of those bigger clinical results. Um, and so, you know, just something to think about when you're considering different options, uh, you know, whether that's surgery, whether that's injections, whether that's a steroid shot, whatever, uh, is, you know, what what outcomes are you looking for? If you're looking for pain reduction, then ask about pain reduction. You know, what are results for quality of life improvement, things like that. And don't always focus on the imaging because that doesn't always mean better results uh, in the same way that just because you have degenerative disc disease does not mean you're going to be uh, you're going to have low back pain, or if you already do have low back pain, it doesn't mean it's the cause of your low back pain. So, just a little airport edition. I'm probably going to be shooting a few of these today, so stay tuned. See you later.